Have you ever looked at the back of a nutritional label and seen potassium chloride on it and wondered, what's its molecular mass? Well, neither have I. But guess what? That's what we're going to do. That's what we're doing today. Take a look. Bam. So the first thing I'm going to do is write the elements down that I see in the compound. So we see potassium K and we see chlorine Cl. Next is then to identify the number of atoms, and that's where the subscripts come into play. Now, if you don't see a subscript at the bottom of that element, there is an, assum there is an assumed one down there. So there's one potassium and also one chlorine. Then we're going to multiply those numbers by the mass of each particular element, and those masses are found on the table. So let's take a look. What table, by the way? Not the table right in front of you, but the, well, this actually is right in front of you. I'm at the physical table in front of you. But this, well, I guess this is physical too, although it's virtual. But this table right here in front of you is going to be the periodic table. So here we got 39.10. We got chlorine is 35.45. So let's write them on down. All right, so here for potassium, we got 39, 39.10. For chlorine, we got 35.45. And all we're simply going to do is multiply the row and across to find the total mass of the element. That's the next step. So here, the total mass of potassium here is going to be 39.10. Total mass of chlorine is then going to be 35. Let me make that a little neater, right? 35. What? 35. There we go. 0.45. Okay. Now that my hand is spazzing. Anyway, uh, add this column on together and... Uh, you will arrive at the total mass of the entire compound, 74.55. And the units down here in terms of AMU, because we're solving for molecular mass, right? So those are the units, atomic mass units, all right? And now you know how to find the molecular mass of potassium chloride. Now that can satisfy your need for wanting to figure that out after looking at that nutritional label. All right, thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon. Take care.